ministers to state here present my delegation and i are here with emotion as i stand here at the same time with joy emotion that uh, in as far back as 1881 as the occupant of the golden stool kofinti then is my son and he comes here after he's been taken to britain where the british thought that they were going to school him to come back and educate my people as if we didn't know what we were doing and that to be schooled in English as if because my language was not acceptable to come back and, Christ and Christianize us. But then the two sons who were taken away, one died and then one, Kofinti, because of tuberculosis, they decided to send him down to Trinidad because the weather was similar to Ghana. And this is the edifice that I see here that he came to design and then construct. So what the British thought they were sending him away, I get a benefit of my brothers and sisters here in Trinidad with this edifice as I stand here. So to me, it is glad, gladdening for me to be here to see this from 1883. And for me now as the occupant of the Gordons to standing here to look at this edifice and say that I proudly say that my son designed and built it. <laughs> that goes to Inyo, to the uh, relationship between Trinidad and Tobago and Ghana. And this affirms the resilience of the black people that we cannot and we shall not be conquered or subdued by any other race but ourselves to develop and then to know that we are civilization started from Africa and whether we like it or not that is how it is and we have to accept that the whole world has to accept that civilization started from Africa it is from Africa that mankind developed into Asia and everywhere else. And therefore we should feel proud that as blacks, my son built this house, designed this one, and therefore I stand here with pride and I come back, I come to Trinidad. When they took my people away from Africa through that gate of no return, they thought I was not going to come back and I'm here. And I've had people from here also coming to Ghana 
So the gate of return couldn't stop us. And we are here now to witness this. The name Kofinti will stand forever. The Asante Kingdom will stand forever with the Trinidad, with Trinidad and Tobago. And I can assure you that I'm here with pride standing under this roof, which was designed and constructed by my son. So I thank you very much for this honor of bringing me here. I thank the government and people of Trinidad and Tobago for letting me experience this edifice of a signal that uh, contributes to the security of Trinidad and Tobago. Thank you.